So let us commence with the doing of one more. This is the flying around one, right? Yes. Oh boy. <laughs> Gee, why would the wheelman be all excited about the flying around one? I don't understand. I can give you over 40,000 reasons why I know that sun isn't real. I know it because the emitter's Rayleigh effect is disproportionate to its suggested size. I know it because its stellar cycle is more symmetrical than that of an actual star. But for all that, I'll never actually know if it looks real, if it feels real. Before this is all over, promise me you'll figure out which one of us is the machine. So what's your plan? Infinity's tracked the Didax vessel to a docking structure southeast of here. We'll jump ship as Infinity exits the roof. You know, I was sent down here with orders to prevent you from leaving. In case you'd already gone, I took the precaution of ordering a pelican. Outfitted for full combat pursuit. I hope to God you're wrong about that forerunner. Or whatever he is, Chief. But in the vent, you're not. Pelican. And Chief. Good luck. Both of you. Nah. <laughs> Come on, Chief. They Take already, a girl for a ride. They already directly disobeyed the, the captain on the bridge by not immediately trying to arrest him, so they don't need to do any of that. Wanna go for a ride? The Didact used this composer to create the Prometheans from ancient humans. If he wants to finish the job, he'll have to find it first. Our best bet to stop him is oh, keep him firmly on record. Let's hope Lasky didn't skimp on that pelican. Yeah, so everything you to join us. This is all kinds of wrong, man. Oh, oh shoot him. Oh, yeah, hold He's on, wait. How dare oh. you? Oh, whoa! The Didact oh, used this composer to create the Prometheans from ancient humans. Okay. If he wants to finish the job, he'll have to find it first. Okay, Our best bet to stop him is keep him firmly on Requiem. Let's hope Lasky didn't skimp on that pelican. Hi, guys. Get in any of them. This is a pretty sweet union we're in. It's fantastic. Stand near the crates, Whoa. but don't ever move them. Right. Are y'all right. lagging? If anybody even oh. looks at the crates, no. what are y'all doing? That's a violation. Oh yeah. We're listening to there? we're listening to Conan and his sidekick chat about being oh, in a sweet so union. If we hang out, will they say Don't you think rugs would warm this up a little bit? Absolutely. Absolutely. Just like Literally, I'm not talking wall to wall, but like five area rugs. Mm hmm. Or some oriental rugs. And you know what? Suddenly it's a whole different vibe in here. Right. I think they got one more set of dialogue. Come on, Conan. I think something's up. What? I think there's going to be a war with an alien they awoke from an ancient slumber. Oh, that, what? that is stupid. I know. I mean, I don't know much. I mostly just load crates, but that is stupid. You know what? There's one thing my grandpa told me. Never awaken an alien from an ancient slumber. <laughs> there you have it, folks. Oh, that's too bad. In, in, in the, the actual opponent, like the taping, he said, hee hee, that's pickle. <laughs> 
doesn't sound like him. Initiating pre-flight diagnostics. Forward auto cannon, check. Lateral rail turrets, check. Main thrusters, check. Auxiliary boosters, check. All right. Keying engine. Checking of the checking, check. It may be a while before we find another ride home. You know that, right? It'll be okay. Inside those shields. Marking two of the larger facilities on your HUD. They're acting as traffic control for resources moving to and from the satellite. If we disrupt their communications, I can forge an override code and convince it to lower those defenses. <laughs> hey, listen, I may not be a wheelman, but I can admit I can manage not to hit giant floating pillars. Transmissions passing that, through this yes. structure, begging, not simply begging, the ones controlling the movement through the satellite shield. Right. Can you isolate the satellite communications? Not quickly, and shutting them all down is not an option. But destroying the system's attenuators should flood the network. Of course, if Infinity wasn't on their way back to Earth, they could overload the attenuators remotely. We'll handle it. That's hardly the point. The attenuators are housed in Faraday and I bet there's a release around here somewhere. Maybe you have to everything else. I don't know. It didn't seem like the captain was the only one who was being a dick. Everybody else was pretty nice to the Master Chief. And I'm not just talking about Lasky, like. Right? Okay, the structure contains three central attenuators. Sever those connections and we should be good. Except for the the one crack about being an aging Spartan who's been off the field for a while, the captain. Well, he gives no indication of why this the captain doesn't like this. The master chief. Nice. Oh, doesn't then dis green eggs and ham and ask the, the people under him to um detain green eggs and ham. Even as I said it sounded Very offhanded. 
matter. There we go. I mean, you return to Earth, and the next thing Lasky's like, hey, so uh, Del Rio was an asshole, and Earth didn't appreciate it. We got rid of him. Hope you don't mind. I'm in charge now. Okay. Yeah, okay, sure. Great. The increased signal traffic is almost entirely blocking I... out the satellite communication. One more target left. Transmission buffers are overflowing. Get us to the second tower. The others scattered like embers over sand. Very much. And yet the librarian's champion is unmoved. Cortana, where's this coming from? Where's what coming from? The mantle of responsibility for the galaxy shelters all of you. But only four of us are its masters. The Didact's voice. I'm not picking up anything. He's there. Keep trying. All right, who wants to drive this time? Covenant air traffic's increasing. If we don't disable the other tower quickly, reaching the didact could become exponentially more difficult. Oh, jeez. Say yes. Say yes. For the love of God, say yes. I should have booted him. That would have been fun. <laughs> See you later, bro. Up uh, on brick, hurry! Oh! <laughs> I, I just lost some of those guys. ODST and where if we don't like the pelican that we the well it wasn't a pelican but the, the ride that we have we can destroy it and just call it another one. Last key can be like really? So. Here I'll get us a new one. Everybody wants to This node's different than the previous tower. <laughs> the source of the tower communication is a carrier wave generator over. located yeah, somewhere inside. Over. It looks like the carrier wave generator is located at the far end of this chamber. Find us a way across. Oh, I didn't know there was any platform. This gondola there. should do the trick. Look for its activation <laughs> switch. Wouldn't be the first time. Oh god, it's a gondola. Because there weren't enough gondolas. To take a page out of our old playbook, 
I'm going to tune your shields to emit an EMP at the same frequency as the communication network. All you'll need to do to trigger it is to make physical contact with the carrier wave generator. That's what she said? Hey, I, I want you to make physical contact, if you know what I mean. Covenant! The Didact's giving them control of the system override. We're going control. to have to wrestle for it. Oh, I guess we can jump back. The controls are up, up there. there. But I have no jump back.
<laughs> the carrier wave generator is on top of that platform. You only have to enter the field to trigger the EMP. Protect me, Bob. Give it a second. Look out! Transmissions between the towers and the satellite have ceased. You are a fool. Even now, your kind tinkers with the composer in the shadow of the third ring. Children in fire who disregard the welfare of the galaxy. <laughs> oh, God. Can't believe you went that far for a bad pun. No, wait, never mind. I am not surprised at all. <laughs> Ooh, light in your face. Light in your face. we keep running into are being controlled from this tower. Get me to the control room and we might be able to reposition them to block the Didact ship from leaving. Um. Um.
Okay, that was weird. <laughs> yeah, as soon as you shut off the, the Spartan laser. Like, nope, you're not done yet. <laughs> Forgot to undo my seatbelt. Let's get some good bungee on. Okay. You will relent, human, or you will perish. All in life is choice, and your day to choose has come. Stargate time. Just shitting. Yeah, you can either steal one or there are several so of them just the sitting. Banshees, the Banshees have to stop and shit and keep going. Come on, 
I am. I am. I know. First off, that's scary. Second off, I am now disappointed in all three of you as geeks and or nerds. Just saying. Understand, but I've always kind of figured that it, Obama might have had a scale on a scale of one to five. It was like a, a George Lucas is right for making the, the prequels, and like he said, like strongly agreed. He goes, "This is just, this is just, I can't vote for this person now." <laughs> Quick, let me at the fire controls. What the um, fuck? Tapping into this fire central um, net. Okay. Let me I have this fire burn so it uh, doesn't include kill uh, uh, Now to imprison them! Guys, I stuck burned and Rick died. This is just gonna be used! Like Thunder Bolt! I swear to God, Bird, right in the back. Chief? His ship's online. They're leaving. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. I don't know what. Oh, so much for my binary rifle. Track those liches. We can go across them to get to the Didact ship. Wait, across them? Yes. Yes. Um, there, there are several liches moving in formation towards the Didact ship. We're only going to have one shot at this. So we should probably not kill each other. Okay. Cortana, what's happening? I don't know. Hang on. Jumping into slip space. Get below deck. No time. 